Hello Internet, welcome back or welcome to my channel. My name is Tori and today I have an update for the Throwback 30 Project Pan. This is a Pantastics Ladies collab. This is started July 28th, 2020 and will end a year from then, July 28th, 2021. So this is a giant Project Pan. This project consists of 30 items that were picked via prompts from past projects. So, um... Yeah, before we jump into it, I do want to say I'm trying to hit 500 by the end of this calendar year, so don't forget to make that red button gray. Thank you in advance. Now let's jump into it. The first thing we have to talk about is I have an empty. So, well, empty slash declutter slash... I don't like putting it on my eyes anymore because it's old. This is the Urban Decay Heavy Metals uh, Glitter Eyeliner. This was for the Wizard of Panning. I picked the monkeys, something you kept saying you're going to pan, but never do. So this is Gamma Ray. Since the last update, I did use Gamma Ray uh, six times, but on um, November 11th, I was like, I can't really be using this anymore. I don't trust this by my eyes. I don't want to use it. I'm trying to think if it's two years old or if it's three years old. I think it's three years old. So, um... <sighs> The liquid starting to creep me out. It's just, nah, -uh. nope. Gonzo. Dunzo. Hospital Vista. Now, everything that's remaining. There's still a lot remaining. Starting from the top with what we have remaining. The first prompt is pan as old as time. This was a eyeshadow project pan where the ladies pan their oldest eyeshadows. Well, oldest eyeshadow palette. Therefore, I rolled in a, one of my oldest eyeshadow singles. This is what I dubbed Tart 4. Um, well, actually, this is Tart 1. See, here's the problem. <laughs> this is Tart 1. I kind of remember that this is Tart 1. Um, so, since the last update, I did only use this once. If you have been watching my past couple videos, I'm going to keep saying it again because it does affect this project. I've been wearing pinks nonstop. This is a different take on the pink look because I hit pan in something today. Unexpected goal. Wasn't a primary focus goal, but it happened. So... I have to switch up my eye looks, but it's still going to be pink for the foreseeable 20 days. So, this isn't getting that much love. I'm not too concerned about it. I don't think it will be, this shade will be finished by the end of this calendar year, but definitely like January, maybe February. This is out. Bet on it. I'm not concerned with it. Next, for Around the World, I picked something made in the USA. So we have the Neat Matrimony Palette, the shade Matte Lynn. My goal is to finish it. I had pan in it last update, or possibly the update before. I'm not going to lie. I can't remember. Since the last update, I did only use this once. I'm trying to finish a shade that literally is the exact same color as this in my Pan That Palette. So once that shade's done, this will be getting used again. But I'm also... Not concerned. Even though this is giant, I'm not concerned at all. Not one bit. Next is for Beauty A to Z. I picked the letter R. So this is a mini Rose Matter liquid lip. So I've used this once since the last update. I think this might be my next uh, focus shade because I just used up literally one of these um, a couple days ago and I realized that all of these minis are starting to like they're pretty much almost all done. So I think this will be my next focused one. I think the next one I focus on. So maybe next update will be done. Maybe the following, but in the near future, this will be done so. Next for Bite My Shiny Metal Pan, I picked the Medusa's Makeup Eyeshadow. If I can open it, there you go. In whatever, my goal with this is to hit pan. I'm focusing in that. Yeah, I'm pretty much focusing in that little spot. Since the last update, I did use it twice. Because of the pinks, I'm not doing my typical outer V colors also because I'm trying to just keep wearing pink. But there has been a couple days, well, two days that I pulled this in. So hopefully I can pull it in again soon. I haven't, I don't, I've said this before. I don't know when this is going to hit pan. I've never tried to hit pan in one of these. So we'll see on that. Next for Blast Into Project Panning, I picked Saturn, which is a pale gold. So I picked ABH 10K. Since the last update only used this once, it's because of the pinks. That's all, you know. Next is for the Chinese Zodiac Sign Project Pan. So I picked the rabbit because I am a rabbit. So I picked Cashew Bunny from the Too Faced Natural Mattes palette. My goal with this is to hit pan. I am going to focus on this side. 
so at least since the last update I have not used it next is drop 10 before summer so I picked this lipstick in Leo since the last update Leo has not been used but I've been swirling it around like I do a rose matter and it's probably got like 10 to 15 uses so once again even though it's not getting love at the moment I'm not concerned for the fellowship of pan I have the Bija cosmetic shadow in wubba lubba dub dub in nice bright blue since the last update it was used once I'm not gonna lie to you once these pink looks are over I'm going to go through a blue phase not on purpose just because I have been so obsessed with all the blues I have in front of me but I'm not allowing myself to wear so even though it's only got one use I'm not concerned you're gonna see me pulling blue looks off you're just you're gonna see it it's gonna happen I don't know how long that fad's gonna be but I know I have a couple blue eyeshadows coming into my life and since I redid my adapt cosmetics palette I just want to play with blues so uh We'll see that soon. Next for food for thought, I picked an eyeshadow from the Too Faced Chocolate Bonbons palette. I picked Cashew Chew. My goal is to completely finish Cashew Chew. Since the last update, I did use it three times. This has been getting a lot of love <laughs> because of the pink looks. I'm trying to think. I am pulling this out of my Shop My Stash because I completed it for Shop My Stash. But I do think that I am going to pull this in my like daily rotation just to focus on Cashew Chew. Yes, I will be competing Cashew Chew against Matt Lynn, which, you know, technically isn't ideal, but I, it's it just, it's what's going to happen. <laughs> I'm just going to do it. It's going to be okay. Um, I'm not to, it's whatever. Technically, should I do that? No, but am I going to? Yeah. Next for Game of Panners, I picked something I received as a gift. So this is the Lorac Mega Pro 4. I picked this palette as a whole. So... My goal with this palette is to use it 50 times. This is what it's currently looking like. Since the last update, I did use it four times. Not the best, but not the worst. It has 34 uses left to go. Yeah, let's see if we can hit some more pans with those 34 uses, you know? Make something good out of it. Next, for Glow to the Ancient Gods, I picked the Disney Villains Color Pop Highlighter in Hades, a.k.a everyone's got a weakness this is what it currently looks like my goal is to hit pan since the last update i did only use it once it was in my shop my stash that's how it got the one use i think this is going to be a focus for when january starts up this is going in my daily rotation and i am going to try to hit pan so if it's not i bet it's not gonna have use by the next update but once come january this is going to be a hardcore focus problem since becca opal is uh not going to be concerned in january i'm not decluttering it but if it's not finished by january it's just gonna sit for a while and marinate next we have two different ones from my abh aurora glow kit so we have go for the goal and we have the harry potter project pan so for gold go for the goal the goal is to hit pan on something so i picked spectra Sorry if you hurt my stomach. Why does my stomach keep growling every time I film? I swear I eat, but I just film before I eat. Yes, yeah, so my goal is to hit pan on Spectra. I have not used it since the last update. However, Luna is in for the Harry Potter Project Pan. My goal is also to hit pan on Luna, and I have used it twice since the last update. Not the best, but not too shabby. I think I did use Luna. I don't remember if I use Luna on my face or in my inner corner. I do tend to use these as eyeshadows because... They're kind of really pretty. So, I think once um, this pink look is over and January starts and I can um, not feel like I have to finish a lot of stuff, um, because I, if, if you've seen my other projects, you know I have a lot of items that are like really close, so I'm trying to focus on them. Once those are out or once the project's done, uh, I can start loving on these where the goal will be easy for me, but I just haven't been able to show it the love it deserves yet. So, 14, in the panning zone. Something that would last through Doomsday. Uh, if you recall, the original item did not last through Doomsday, but this new one I pulled in does. So this is uh, from the Androgyny palette from the Naked Mole Rat, the shade Deja Vu. My goal, what is my goal with Deja Vu? Is my, I think my goal is still to hit pan. Um, I'm not gonna lie to you, I can't remember. My list is a mess. I think it's still to hit pan. Since the last update, I did use it once. Not too shabby, but like I said, pink looks. Pink looks taken over. Next, this item I've been liking a lot. So this is the um, Let's Give Her A 
I picked Bad Milk, which is a product in weird packaging. So I picked a macaron, macaron lip balm. So this is the raspberry macaron lip balm. Where are these mind stats? Since the last update, it says I only used it twice. I think that's why. I think I used it four times. Um, my goal is to completely finish it. I've really been liking this. I've been really liking lip balm. I've been taking great care of my lips, surprisingly, recently. So I've been having fun with that. Next is for lip service, a lip product I pulled in the Urban Decay lipstick in 1993. Of course, my goal is to finish it because why wouldn't it be? Since the last update, I did use it once. Not too shabby. Next is Lucy, you have some panning to do. So I linked my product to Bewitch because this is the Wet n Wild highlighter and not your basic witch. So this is what it looks like. My goal is to hit pan on it. Since the last update, I didn't touch it because it's currently not in rotation. I forgot about that. Uh, this will be getting pulled in once the goal is hit on this because I use them both as eyeshadow. So that's how, that's when that will be getting action. I didn't like that. That's when that one will be getting love. Okay, next for category number 20, it's a nightmare before Christmas. So I picked also from the Androgyny palette, this shade as a whole is Charm. So I wanna completely finish Charm. Charm was used once since the last update pink that's all like that's all i really gotta say on that next is the urban decay eyeliner in space dust so this is what it currently looks like since the last update i did only use it once but i've found a new purpose for it thanks to danny so besides using it as a typical eyeliner Danny was like layering it and then would put like a, an eyeshadow that needed a little help on top and I did that with one shade I was trying to finish and I loved it so I need to that's how I'm gonna use it pretty much I was going to originally use it today to get an extra goose but then um, I really wanted to hit pan on the eyeshadow that's in my uh, inner corner and um, well not my inner corner but my inner lid and a uh, fun fact I did so I did not put this under it or on top of it because then it would have just not I wanted to give it a time to shine since I hit pan on it today that's pretty much what I'm saying so this didn't get love today but I'm not concerned because now it has a new purpose um and I'd rather use this over eye primer yeah weird but I've I've learned that recently so that won't be ending love uh, soon that was for the Sailor Moon Project Pan and I linked that to Sailor Moon I didn't even say that see I just ramble I really do next is for the Rocky Horror Picture Show for Frank, I just picked the Jordana um, Easy for easy Liner for the Eyes Retractable Eyebrow Pencil in Jet Black. Um, I haven't touched this. So I finally just finished the liquid eyeliner I was working on. So this will be getting love any day now. So this makes me very happy. And then plus come January and this will be the only black eyeliner I'm focusing on because it's the oldest black eyeliner I own. So... We'll get this done soon. For Saturday morning pans, I have the Etude House Tom and Jerry eyeshadow and best friends. My goal with this is to use it 22 times. Since the last update, I used it twice. I really like this. So it has 15 more uses left to go. I think that this might be the number goal I focus on completing next because I really like wearing it. So those two uses were like weekend uses. When I allow myself to use anything in my collection, I reached for this. So, not concerned with this one. I'm gonna assume this goal is probably gonna be finished by January, February. I feel like that's my timeline for everything in this project. That seems like it could be close to being done just because I don't wanna shorten the timeline and then feel bad when it's not completed, you know what I mean? Next, for Say Good Day to Project Panning, I picked the category Cuddly Koala, so it was something with, once again, cute packaging. So this is the Urban Decay Lipstick in Devilish, yeah. Um, my goal is also to use it 22 times since the last update I did use it once so not too shabby um, it has 18 more uses left to go like I said before I really do like this lipstick so bueno and next I have the uh, my pet chose my highlighter this is the Disney pop Disney pop Ooh, Disney and color pop I mean they might as well be called Disney pop with all the you know collabs they begin um, this is the Big Tough Girl Highlighter, aka the Megara Highlighter. My goal with this is to also use it 22 times. Since the last update, I did use it three times. This highlighter is currently in my rotation. It has 18 more uses left to go. Same thing. I think that this goal could be done by, like, January, February. I just keep saying end of 
January and February just being more realistic because I know I'm gonna focus hard on like A to Z and uh, I was gonna say I was gonna focus hard on Pet Cemetery, but I'm not gonna lie to you I'm ending that project early So you'll see that finale in a couple days, um, but then like team project pan um, And partners on cream. I just want to try to see if I can use anything else more up. So These won't be getting that much love till those projects end pretty much Next, I have for the skin is in, I have the Formula 10 One Deep Detoxifying Face Wash with Charcoal and Willow Bark. So, mine is disgusting. I finally brought it out of the bathroom to show y'all. Um, let's see, since the last update, I did use it four times. I felt like I used it a little more than that. Maybe I'm missing tallies, um, since I do. What I've been using with this recently is I will pre-put it on my face, wash it into my face. Like massage it into my face and then when I hop in the shower I rinse it off but I also did use it this morning because my face just needed the help so I am NOT using it every single day should I probably but I'm not because <laughs> so I do need to pick up the usage a little bit I, d I know I'm gonna finish it by the end of the project but like still I would like to just pick up the use in general help my face out a little bit so the next project is for the four seasons I picked spring, so I picked this uh, City Color B Matte Blush in Blackberry. My goal will be to finish it. <sighs> we'll see about that one. Since the last update, I did use it four times. Once January comes, this is... I think that this will only be competing with one other blush in January. So I'm not too concerned about it. Not concerned at all. This next item, no, last item, is for the Painting Club. I picked the Criminal, something that makes you feel badass. I picked this because of the shade this is Sagittarius since the last update I have not used it just because it doesn't look good with many of the pink looks I've been doing wait that's a lie I did use it I didn't even remember I used it oh uh, okay so I lied to you since the last update I did use it two times I didn't use it with pink looks so I used it like randomly um this has a lot of gaping this is most likely going to be the next full size from him that I focus on because similar to Rose Matter and Leo, like 10 to 15 uses, not even. Um, so that's gonna be great. That's gonna be fun to completely use up and finish. But yeah, now it's my time to completely use up and finish some of these. So yeah, my immediate goal for the next month is just to try to keep up progress. I mean, if there's an empty that's amazing if goals hit that's amazing but it's not going to be my main focus for next month um i definitely think we'll start seeing more progress and more like empties and goals hit in end of january end of february just because how life is going <laughs> so yeah this is how this project's currently going i would say not too shabby at all so yeah, if you enjoy me and you enjoy Project Pan videos, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and all that jazz. And peace out, girl, let's go.